Aha! Another fallen piece of Asgard. Something seems a bit different about this one. Different? Dunno. I've just a funny feeling. Your analytical mind knows no doubt. Hang on a minute. Is this a prison? It would seem so. Let's continue. Might be something useful inside. Freya! I can't believe it. Wait. That can't be. Lord Tyr. Is this an illusion? No, brother. No, I think it's the real deal. Mimir? Is that you, old friend? In all the important ways, I. There was such a commotion. If Odin learns what you've done... Odin is dead. The realms are at last free of him. You're safe. Odin's dead. And Asgard fallen. So the reign of the Aesir is truly over. That's quite a lot to take in. And you are. His name is Kratos. Kratos? I, I know that name. Come. You need real shelter. Food. No. No, what I need most now, I think, is to reflect on what you've told me. I need space, if you would grant me that. Very well. Our home is in the realm between realms for the moment. You can find us there when you're ready. Kratos. I know you from somewhere. I'm sure it will come back to me. Until then. Was truly him. It's hard to trust anything after what we've been through. But with Odin gone, I have no cause to doubt it. Our paths will cross again. Of that, I'm sure. <laughs> Well, now we know what this prison's for. This is where Odin stashed those he would camouflage himself as. Makes sense. If you're going to imitate someone, you wouldn't want them walking around. Why not kill them? He must need them alive in order to assume their form. Aye. Odin likely wanted Tyr dead for a multitude of reasons. But he knew Tyr would be more useful alive. Your god of war has truly returned. What now? He'll want to stretch his legs, I imagine. Imprisonment stokes wonderlust. Not that I need to remind any of us of that. Saw him disappear at Ragnarok. That can only mean the legend was true all along. That blow from Thor sent Jormungandr straight back in time. A younger Jormi, fresh from Jotunheim, would grow into the serpent we know. When we first met the snake, you said that he found a trace familiar. Perhaps they met in Jotunheim. Perhaps so, brother. We'll have to ask the lad for that story when we next see him. Tear. I would be left alone. Please. Of course. What a beautiful dagger. Impractical. Ceremonial. Now where have we seen an artifact like that before? Here's vault. What happened here? Surtur sacrificed himself for Ragnarok. Perhaps he was able to find peace after all. I always felt sorry for him and Sinmara. She's still alive, if you wish to speak to her. I was in Niflheim briefly. A weeping emanates from the realm. I think she's grieving. And may grieve for a long while yet. You saved them, Freya. I did nothing. No. I did nothing. Scratching tally marks into a cell while the world ended around me. You returned to your people. You endured their hatred. You helped them become more. Freya and his soldiers... They survived. They endured. But there's a reason the tide turned when the goddess Freya returned home. Your love of this place... I can feel it. 
Smell it in the breeze. Anyone can. That love makes you strong. Makes your people strong. It's why you won. I... Thank you. It's still here. Aye. But it's no longer chained. You freed it? Tried to. But as you can see... Even if he couldn't escape, some part of him appreciates what you did. If you say so. I was a prisoner of Odin's. Same as this creature. Same as you. I assume Kratos took your head? Aye. And do you resent him for his inability to free your body? Of course not. But... Then perhaps you have some idea of how this creature feels. Ah. Uh, we will leave you in peace. Freyr. He forged a piece. Of a sort. Wish I could have seen that. I'm sure he wished the same. If you'll... Excuse me. I wish to pay my respects to your brother. In my own way. Of course. Let's go, Kratos. <laughs>